Good morning, Facebook. This is Danielle, a woman I am, and I wanted to tell you all about this dream that I had about a month or so ago. And so, in the dream, um, there was like this system set up in the world that people knew not of. But the people that did know were the people of God, because God has showed these people God showed his people what was going on within those systems of the world. And so all of a sudden, after all of this um, preparation and this um, thing that they were doing within the system, they were preparing people to be put into this one, like, subsidized area. They were having these people, and many of these people, they were just lost. Once again, these were good people. These were people that worked. These were people that had families. These were people that was caring and loving. But they were not the people of God. And so, when it was time for everyone to be locked into this um, area where they had put to the side for those that did not know what was going on in this system, it happened. And it was like this large ship that covered the sky. And when it came, everyone began to look up. Everyone began to look up at this ship. But the people of God were saved. The people of God, they were looking up at this ship. But they were looking up at the ship like, we knew it was coming. We knew it was coming. But we seen those that did not see it coming. And there were many people that were warned. There were many people that were warned and that God was using us to tell them about the systems of this world and the things going on in this world and to not get caught up. But they did what they wanted to do. Like I said, these were working people. These were people that had families, all that good stuff. But they were not the people of God. And so as they began... These people did not, when the ship came, these people did not even have a chance to break free or to, they didn't even have an option anymore. Because by the time the ship came, these people had like a chip, somewhat, it was something like the New World Order. These people had like a chip inserted in them, so they could not even, it was like when the chip was turned on, they were... They gravitated, they were like, it was like a magnet. They instantly connect to this, to this area where they had blocked off and set off for the people that were lost. And so, we the people of God, we were running around like, we knew this was coming. We was just grabbing our stuff like we was at the grocery store like, I want this, I want that. We had no worries. We had no worries. But there were still some people that were running around trying to tell people like, you better get it together. You better do what you got to do. This thing is about to happen. They ain't pay no attention. So anyway, like I said, I had this dream about a month ago. And so God was just showing me when I woke up, like, what was that about? If it was of you, God, because once again, all dreams don't come from God. And God was just showing me how do not get caught up in the systems of this world. You better get caught up with the kingdom of God because God is going to show. He shows he show his people what we need to see to break free from bondage, slavery, anything that we need. That will not have us bound. God, he sets the captives free. He set us free. And God says, my sheep know my voice. And the thing with that is that God is telling us and God will show us what we need to do. He's going to give it to us. He's not. God is not going to allow us to be caught up in the systems of this world that will kill, that will kill us. It, it will kill us spiritually, mentally, emotionally, physically, everything. I see it every day. I work downtown. I see people come to work frustrated, miserable, unhappy, but they make good money and they do this thing routinely. This is their lifestyle. They're like robots. So I just want to tell you all to be careful. God is showing, God is giving us a way out. He is giving us a way out so that we begin, we're living in the kingdom of God. The kingdom, the goodness, the fruit, the joy, all of those good things that come with God. 
So don't get caught up with the systems of this world. And don't get caught up to where that you'll be lost and you'll get caught up and you'll become um you'll get set in this system to in, in the way in such a way that you cannot get out of. Be set in the kingdom of God. Bless you all. This is Daniela Woman I Am. And I just pray that we continue to be steadfast, that we continue to pray and fast and consecrate, have a consecrated lifestyle, and that we continue to ask God to show us the way to the kingdom of God so that we don't get caught up in this system, these systems of the world. Bless you all.